Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Poly channel. This video I want to share about global lab update at 5 November 2021 maintenance update. But be notice all content on this global lab video was recorded on global lab server. So this is all content that will update on our live server in future. And mostly all this update will implement on Korea live server for next maintenance update and following outside Korea server if they or be feel this content already ready to release outside Korea server globally. Okay to enjoy Enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, this is official website for global lab update at 5 November 2021 maintenance update. First about GM note about class reward, on this GM note, GM just mentioned about balancing all class rework that already apply since announcement from previous week and they will balancing all class that got rework from any opinion that they got from any player and in this GM note, they just mention five things that they will focus for this balancing, either to balancing any grab and guard mode, balance for number defense and status effect for some class, and also balancing for PvE, especially for pet damage by some class. And also they will adjust 3 minute buff and basic passive effect. I think this 3 minute buff is a buff. And also focus for balancing resistant effect for some class. And once again, class rework still on balancing process. And all 17 class that got rework will be implement in the same time on our live server in future. I expect at end of 2021. And in this week global lab update, all previous class that got rework, they just mentioned some chains. But be notice all this change is temporary change. So if you want to more detail about this change, you can check on this video description. I already put link for this translated website on this video description. You can check it for more detail. And in this video, I will mention some skill that very visual to understand. Like for Berserker skill, they just make some flow combo more smoothly. Like you can see on this video clip. And this combo skill for Berserker bit brutal. And special for timer skill, especially for timer awakening skill, legendary for beast dance. They just change the skill description as I show you translated version on the screen. And for ninja class, they just add new skill, especially for succession. And as you can see, this is translated version for this new skill. And also another new skill that you can see the translated version for this skill description on the screen. And this is skill animation for this skill. And also they just change some skill animation as you can see on the screen. But because I didn't play ninja, I didn't know more detail about this skill. You can comment on this comment section what kind of skill of this animation and once again for more detail for any class that got balancing from this class rework you can check on this video description i already put link for this translated website on this video description okay next improvement about character they will fix some skill when you use some skill on different hit terrain because sometimes when we using skill and move to sloppy terrain our character will do drop action and make our skill cancel as you can see for example my ranger when using this her animation will stop because of this falling animation and they will fix it in future Okay, next improvement for battle arena. In future, if you go to battle arena and using target NPC dummy, if you use any skill that have effect crowd control, like knockdown, floating, bound, stun, stiffness, knockback, grab, or freezing, this target NPC dummy will have some notification like this that mention how long the CC effect will apply and also have some CC bar. If you make this bar depleted, this target will immune to crowd control skill for some time. As you can see with this shield logo and have some timer for this immune period. So you can know more detail timing for use this CC skill when you try some skill on battle arena using this dummy NPC. And you don't need to ask another player just for sparring and counting for this crowd control skill effect period. And another content improvement, when you summoning black spirit using character for level 30 or below, your character will not attract attention for any monster. And also in future, they will update the season banner when you try to create new character, so anyone can know any kind of benefit by playing seasonal character. Okay, next improvement about guild drilling content. Actually, this content still not apply on our live server outside Korea server because this content still balancing on Korea server and they just change reward for this gold drilling content. 
But I think this is not a big deal for us outside Korea server because we will get updated version for this guild drilling content. Actually, they just buff this guild drilling content reward to become have more reward and also they just add new item as ammunition for guild tank that I will show you on this week global lab update later. And also in future when this drilling content apply on our live server, if you fail to complete this drilling content and your guild drilling machine destroy, you also will get this reward that already refam in future. But for sure, this reward is less than if you success to complete this drilling content. And as you can see, this reward, if I translate it, this name is Red Magical Crystal. Actually, this item is material to craft gold tank ammunition. As you can see on screen, this is gold tank that Prebis already developed it completely. That I mentioned before, Prebis already developed it since 11 March 2021, and they already announced it before at 11 March 2021 Global Lab Update. But at this time, this is still under development. They feel this gold tank already ready to be released. And as you can see on this screen, this is how it's look for this gold tank. This gold tank will move using horse, but I didn't know the tail for this horse. And this gold tank only available for Conquest War, for Calpeon, Media, and Valencia region. And to operate this gold tank, you need two people to operate it. One person to move this gold tank, and another person to control this gold tank gun to fire to target location. But be noticed to shoot using this gold tank, you need to craft special item. For this gold tank ammunition, that you get this main resource from gold drilling content, and this gold tank attack very effective to attack gate, wall, and barricade. But be noticed, this gold tank will get higher damage if encountered by elephant and horse. And this gold tank only can be active during conquest war only. And when conquest war end, this gold tank will automatically destroy. And be noticed, you can get this gold tank by destroying any kind of military wagon that appear randomly on any siege war location between one or two hour after start of this conquest war. And guild with highest contribution when destroying this military wagon will have ownership to summon this guild tank. And this guild tank only will active for one hour period after you summon it. So actually, this guild tank you didn't need to craft it. You just need to destroy military wagon that randomly appear after one or two hour during siege war. An item that you must prepare previously is this guild tank ammunition that you only can get this guild tank ammunition by crafting it from guild drilling content that will release. In future, okay. Next, it's weapon for conquest war. They are the buff ballista weapon. They will increase movement speed, rotation speed, and basic operation speed for this ballista by 50% more than before. And also, damage this ballista against gate, wall, barricade, fort, and any castle will increase by 30%. But when this ballista hit any target player, damage will increase by 20%. And special for another building like supply depot, recovery station, and any tower will increase by 100%. Its mean become double, and also in future they will update world map function, especially for not war and conquest war information filter to become shown exact location for this its war location area, so you can know more detail where this its war location from world map information and schedule participant for not war. They already change it to become have more day than before. That previously for its territory they just sign for three days war. So in future for its territory not war, you can do not war almost every day except Friday and Saturday. And also they will change tier for not war divide by territory for Balenos and Serendia to become tier one not war. Media tier two. Valencia tier 3 and tier 4 for Calpeon and Kama Silvia region and also maximum participant for this not war is depend on its territory as you can see on this list maximum participant on not war will occur on Calpeon area that 100 people can participate on this not war and also limit status for tier 2 and tier 3 not war will be adjust following on this table you can check it for more detail okay next improvement for user interface they just add more setting to view guild or clan name instead of alliance name so you can switch to display another player guild name instead alliance name and also another change and fix but i think all of this not to a big deal okay that's all global lab update for 5 november 2021 maintenance update and special thanks to all my membership for direct support via patreon karya karsa and youtube membership and also my current member zekru dubiadut jimmy snack doki aganim scepter renegades x aegis to guild from na server gospel Homie, 
Ayrton, Tepan Gaming, Kill Steel, Remy, Cloudy, Davin Jion Chung, Edward Mabolim as Gold Member, and also all my Silver and Bronze Member. Thank you so much for all your direct support. This will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video, depend on your support level. And be noticed for some level there are have some limit, so make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. And I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karekarsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching, see you next time!